Currently, there is an epidemic of eating disorders plaguing the younger generations of dancers. The hype these dancers have for being extremely thin, and for their legs to be very long and lean, seems to be getting a little out of hand. The focus should not only be on how thin a dancer is, but also on how healthy they are. Having the body of professional ballet dancer is something that many girls strive for, but there needs to be a balance between being able to be physically active and having a healthy body weight. Ballet dancers naturally want to be thin in order to keep up with the trends of being very shapely and slender. However, there are many disadvantages of being too thin and trying to maintain this image as well as being a ballet dancer. Ballet is one of the most beneficial forms of exercise, it increases flexibility, agility, strength, and muscular endurance. Ballet is also a form of artistic expression, in addition to the inner health benefits provided by ballet. Dancers also have a unique way of expressing themselves which can be very attractive to onlookers. Ballet is a great activity for children and teens because it forces them to be disciplined and organized. All these benefits combined make dance a super healthy activity that almost everyone should do. Most dancers would likely agree that ballet is a great workout. In fact, many people have taken up ballet to improve their strength and flexibility or simply to obtain a better body. If you are thinking about taking up ballet, there are certain things you should know about it before beginning. By taking ballet lessons, the muscles that are worked during classes are the same muscles that get exercised in any other physical activity. Anyone who goes dancing will experience exactly the same feelings as a ballerina. In addition, it's been proven that learning ballerina-type positions is quite helpful for pregnant women due to the less stressful body positions and better balance. Ballet is an art form that stresses a dancer's physical being. It's important to have a strong and healthy body so that you can progress with your dance and be able to be as good as possible. If you're just beginning dance then try out some of the suggestions mentioned in this article, so that ballet becomes a form of art that is just as stress-free as it is beautiful. Working as a ballet dancer can be a demanding and rigorous career. Ballet dancers work long hours in order to perfect their craft. With their shapely, lean frames, it is easy to assume that all people who dance look this way. The truth of the matter is that it requires a lot of hard work and dedication to achieve the body that ballet demands. The world of dance is far more physical than most give it credit for. Ballet dancers literally have a long mile to go through to perfect the art. They may make it look effortless, but looks can be deceiving. As they master their trade, they ensure they stay healthy and fit through a variety of measures varying from diet, exercise, and even stretching. Ballet is a very difficult sport and hard to master. You will have to keep practicing and eating right to stay fit and healthy. The training that takes place in ballet class involves many different aspects of the body, including the brain. Achieving great things such as this takes determination, hard work and keeping a positive attitude no matter how challenging it seems. Ballet is a sport that will greatly improve your overall health in the long run if you stick with it. Ballet has often been viewed as an art form for the elite and for the privileged. Many people mistakenly believe that ballet dancers have long and lean, willowy frames. When you take a look at the body shapes of ballet dancers actually performing on stage, this is not the case. As a matter of fact, statistically speaking many ballet dancers have fuller builds than average people. Ballet and a healthy body are not mutually exclusive. The exercises, stretches, and advice in this article can help you to improve your body's flexibility and how you move. Many of these exercises will also make it easier for you to perform the moves that you learned in ballet class. Just don't forget to always warm up your body before beginning any exercise routine. Ballet is a great way to stay in shape, whether for the purposes of ballet or for any other sport. So does ballet give you an idea of diet? Absolutely correct diet and exercise are the most important things for anyone to stick to. The diet we need to look at is not hard. Minimally processed vegetables and fruit will make up the bulk of a healthy diet. Cooking your own food from ingredients with few additives or preservatives is healthier than anything you can buy in the store. 
sweat breaks down the fat that leads to cellulite, which is what plagues many people today. Make lots of veggies and fruits, maintain a good BMI, and dance in tights. Ballet isn't just a hobby millions of women enjoy, it is a physical activity that yields positive health benefits. Regardless if you are a beginner or advanced, the discipline and the mental exercise has been shown to yield positive results, pun intended. The strength of your heart is key to your overall health, and while that may not apply directly to ballet, everyone should have a healthy body. I would suggest ballet is a great exercise even for men. It works your heart and lungs while keeping your body in an upright position so there is less strenuous pressure on the vertebrae of your lower back. Ballet requires flexibility and strength, which are key to a healthy body. I would advise that anyone who wishes to be more active should start with small things like going to the gym or walking briskly. And if anyone not familiar with ballet thinks the exercises look easy, it's not. Your muscles will ache for days after you take one class. Ballet is a great exercise that you can enjoy with no bad side effects. For those who are thinking about taking ballet as exercise, be sure to remember that classes will not only focus on the dance moves themselves. Choosing a local studio that offers both ballet and strength training options is key, so you don't leave less fit than when you started. In recent years though, ballet has shed its dainty image, as ballerinas have discovered that ballet can be a great way to stay fit and trim as well. Ballet stretching and strength building exercises have become part of their daily routine, and they are better able to keep their bodies in shape. The aesthetic value of ballet has declined slightly over the years, but these women are now more athletic than most people can imagine, and the sport is gaining popularity among women who want to keep fit for summer. So, in the end, ballet certainly isn't a cure-all to weight issues caused by fast food but it can be a great workout to supplement your regular exercise routine. If you're interested in trying it out for size, ask your local dance instructor if she offers any classes for beginners. And don't forget your point shoes. I hope this topic has inspired you to try something new, or given your children the opportunity to enjoy a great new sport. With physical benefits, social benefits, and even rehabilitative benefits for older adults, Ballet is a great choice for many people. It also provides great mental benefits as well as cultural or social benefits. These are all excellent reasons to try something new and interesting in 2016 either with your children or on your own.